Gary Boys here and today I am going to be showing you how to make a quick animation of Minecraft animation in Blender. So first of all, I'm going to want to open Blender. I have for it to load. Bloody party. Okay, just a quick away from that. Hey, you want to go file, open. Find where you um, downloaded the thing and should be Minecraft body underscore bend. The links for Blender and the um, thing will be in the description. Okay, just open that and then you have from this. Okay, you're going to want to press B and select all of that. Not the dirt. Press delete, delete. Okay. Now, what we're also going to want to do is go here and drag it up a bit around there ish. Then go view. No, not view. Here. And go timeline. Okay. Then you're going to scroll in, just, just scroll like normal, come all the way here. Now, so you know what you're recording, you go to view, this top one, not that one. You, okay, you go view, camera, and that's what you're going to be recording. Today, all we're going to do is a simple uh, wave. What you're going to want to do next is come all the way over here, I'm pretty sure, um, I'm just going to quickly, no not there, um, oh, going to want to select the person, sorry, with a, with a right click, um, should be something here, I'll go here, to like, bone thing, and then, Click. It's not there. Okay, I'll be back when I find it. Okay, I found. I found it. Now in here, you click on that. Come across. Pull this up a bit, and click X-ray. Then you pull it back down. Now, as you can see now, the bones. Like all the bones are here. Um, first thing that you're going to need to do is select all the bones. So hold shift and right click on all the bones. Okay. Um, yeah. Keep, uh, oh. So select all the bones. Yep. Oh yeah, and down here, make sure you're on frame one, and should say it in brackets there. Okay, once you've selected all the bones, press I, then lock, rot, scale, which stands for location, rotation, scale. Click on that. Okay, next, what you do is you come over here and drag that that way. Push continue with the record button. Next, you find frame 5 or wherever you want to go. Click record. Right click on this, no, this bone. And then drag it around there. Left click, press that. And if we move this, yep, it Turns and they go to frame 10. So I'll be okay, so yeah, we're at frame 10 now. You click the record again, bring it up to where you want. So there, click the record. There, now you can yep, go to 15 and just keep doing this to there. 
click it again, go to 20, click it, then you bring it up here, click it, just making sure, go to 25, click here, move it back around there, click there, go to 30, click it again, then click it, and you bring it back up. Okay, do this as many times as you want, like the waving bit, and I'll be back when I've finished with Okay, I'm back. Um, I haven't done a lot, but I've done enough. Okay, now we go to the next ring. Bring it down, around to there. Oh, no. Press Control Z. Okay. Make sure that so we're selected on the right frame. Okay. Make sure we're selected on the right frame. Click record. Bring it down. Down to there. Click record. And just keep doing this to. Oh, whoops. Control Z. Okay. Go to there. Record. Bring it down. Record 55. Record. Bring it down. So like that. And click record. Now it's done the waving, and you can just try guessing and like quickly watch it. Now next part is um is like I'm just quickly click something. Okay. Next part is to render it. Now, you're going to want to go click on the camera, drag it across, bring this up so you can see everything, drag it across. Now, what you're going to do is come here because if if it's in an image, all your frames will come out as images. I'm going to want movie. Okay. Um, just pick what you want. So I'm going to choose um, AVIJ bed. Okay. You can choose what you want. <coughs> now to choose where you want it to save, you just on top of it, click here. And I'm going to do it on my desktop. And then accept. Next, you drag it across. Now, this is important. So, I'm going to drag that up a bit. Now, this next step is important. Go here to end, end frame, and you got to type in your last frame. So, mine is 55. Okay. Then you just go back, click Render Animation, and it'll start rendering. And I will be back when mine is finished rendering. Okay, it has finished recording. I mean, not recording, blend, uh, not blending. It has, it has finished rendering. That's it. Now, if you want to keep the file, like if you want to add on to it or something, just go File, Save As. And just choose where you want. Say desktop, and just name it. Um, hello. There. Save as Blender file. Okay. Now you can exit out of this. And on your front page, there should be a video. The video that you recorded. You can rename it. Hello or something. I don't know. Your choice. Okay. We're going to watch it now. Just need to wait for it to load. Da -da -da. Um, I'm back again. Uh, my recording stopped because I have a 10 minute limit. Okay, now we're just going to play our animation. Um, I know why this happened, why I don't have color. What you, what you have to do, um, get out of that. Whoa, what's 
took my mouse. Oh, just ignore that. Okay, go into Blender again. I'm going to this is the last bit. Should, I should have said earlier, but open reason. Um, just open the thing. Yeah. You may have to render it again. Well, file, open reason. Hello. Um, press, yeah, you press escape there. Now, what you have to do here, it is important. You, get, you click on here, I'm pretty sure. So I'll be back when I find it. Now I'm back and I found it. Up and on the top bar, there should be a little circle. Click on that and click texture. Now it should, now when you render it, it won't be just black. It will be, it will have the colors in that. Okay, so sorry for that little mix up and things. Um, thank you for watching. Uh, please check out other videos that I've done. And see you later.